Let's go, bitches! With me now! Not today, Sally. Good. New show. Any odd. Uh... Runts, pokes, enlisted, officers, NCOs. It doesn't matter what you did in the military. You are going to relate to at least one of the characters in the show. Because we've got them all. Josh, take it away. We've got Lieutenant Anderson, who is uh, played by the, the star of internet stage and screen, Donut Operator. You're about to fuck me, aren't you, sir? <laughs> A thorough raw dogging LT. He is the lieutenant, the adjutant in charge of reviewing the award the whole series is based on. Consider this adjutant ass pounded. He's the guy that still believes, he still believes the awards can work. He's still got that little bit of romanticism left for the military. Uh, and when everyone else has given up, he's the one guy that thinks the awards should go to the people they deserve it. Medal of Honor, sir. I've played the game. <laughs> we all have, no need to brag about it. And then we've got, of course, the we've got the subject of the award, Captain Stoltz. Bombs and bullets won't beat the Taliban. It's about inspiring and empowering the people. Uh, he's our, our uh, boy scout. He's, he's the captain that everyone likes as an affable guy, uh, but wouldn't, wouldn't put your life in his hands uh, on the battlefield. Like, not, not the best judgment, a little overly optimistic in terms of uh, maybe the trust of the Afghan people. You don't need a translator to build a relationship. Just some raw, one-on-one, man-to-man -on -one, -man time. So, you know, that commander, you like him, uh, you, don't, you don't trust him. Good initiative, bad judgment. Yep. All right, so uh, who else we got? We got first squad, right? So, like we said, this is a this is an infantry platoon. So, our first squad, first squad leader, Sergeant Perez. If shit goes bad, what are we supposed to use? Smoke signals? Sergeant Perez has been there, done that a couple times. His give a fuck factor is low, but you know, he's still going to get the job done. Let's go, let's go! He has to kind of deal with bad decisions that are made above him and dealing with junior soldiers. Say, someone that's very trigger happy. How do you, as a squad leader, have to deal with something like that? We know that person, if he is just going crazy the entire time wanting to kill somebody, how do you handle that? I know that was crazy for me, I dealt with that. Like, will you guys calm down, please? Anyways, what else we got? We got mortars. Listen to this. <laughs> mortars. Fuck these motherfuckers down! Yeah. I already have my own opinion about them, but then we have this one soldier, Katri. I write down all my kills in here, boys, and I read them before I hit the hay. Keeps me thirsty. <sighs> he's the guy that probably sat inside the wire, didn't do anything the entire time, but every time he's telling a story to his junior soldiers, he's done everything. Talks a big game. Big game! What you do? You ain't do nothing. We all know that guy. Oh, hey, I gotta keep some secrets to myself. He ain't did nothing, but he ain't did nothing. What you do? You got all the stories, though. I'm done. So you're gonna love to hate Katri. And, <laughs> and there's gonna be plenty of other characters that you're going to love and hate, but at the very least, you're gonna to relate to every single one of them because they're all based on real people, okay? They, these guys and Jessica wrote the show based on real people who have served in the US military, both in the Army and the Marine Corps. We channeled them all into this story, V for Valor, that you're gonna fucking love because it's going to remind you that everything you have felt has been validated by everyone else who's been there. So. Be for Valor, you're gonna love everything about it from the way that, the style that we filmed it. Let's go! Yeah! We, 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 we. Praise Allah. No. Praise America. So check out Be for Valor, bro. It's only on Vet TV and it's only $5 a month, so there's no reason that you can't afford that. It's a show that you're absolutely going to love because it was made specifically for you. Check it out, Peace, Love, War. What'd you do? I'm just getting six. We're not gonna smoke them. Fuck what they taught you in recruiter school. Use your assets. You get what I'm saying? What is this? A back massager? Damn!